Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and we're going to try this one more time. We're going to do the Daily Vibes for August 5th. Um, fourth time is a charm, right? I say third time's a charm. Well, what do they call the fourth time? Fourth time is, you know, fours is the angel number, so I think we can get it right this time. <laughs> we'll try. The other ones might have been right. I don't know. I don't know. Um, I think I'm in a better space now, so um, let's see what we can do. We're going to try it for the fourth time. I think four is good. Four is good. So let's see what we got here. I'm having a cigarette. I'm trying to finish my pack. Um, tomorrow I quit. Tomorrow I quit. Again, this time hopefully it's for good. So tomorrow's a new day. August 5th, 40 days and 40 nights. Okay, that's my plan. I'm, I got a, I got a plan. I got a plan for it. 40 days and 40 nights. So now we got three fours. Four, four, four. Four, four, four. So, and this is my fourth time trying to quit. Well, that makes sense. So I think it's going to be successful this time because four happens to be my number. So I think the fourth time is the best time for me. So let's, let's see. What do we got for the 5th? Today happens to be the 4th that I am recording this. Ooh, the Emperor reversed. We got a challenge here. Oh, it's not reversed, is it? It's, it's challenging. It's challenge. A challenge to regain structure. It's a challenge to um, stay upright. It's a, it's, we have uh, somebody that is needing to gain structure, needing to gain order, needing to gain control. It is hard. It's hard to remain in control. So somebody may be losing control or they may be clinging to control. Um, I'm not, I'm going to put this back in the deck because I don't know whether to take it upright or reversed. So let me just put that right out. So we got somebody here that is struggling to stay in control, struggling with self-control. Hmm. I mean, the emperor is in that kind of position. This guy may have anger issues. There could be anger issues. There could be concentration issues. Somebody could be losing their concentration, struggling to concentrate, concentrate, <laughs> struggling to be in control. Somebody's losing it by the looks of things. Um, I decided to use my favorite deck as well. Hmm. We have a new beginning here. We do. We have a new beginning. This is seizing an opportunity. Somebody is giving up on an unrequited love situation. They are. I'm not going to put in effort into an unrequited love situation where there's no feelings. They've learned their lesson. Somebody has learned a lesson and they're ready to step into a new life. This is a completion, a major completion. This is seizing a new opportunity, letting go, letting go of the regrets. It's the end of stagnation. Looking forward now. Now somebody is interested. Something has been hidden though with the moon card because it's something that some some sort of truth has been hidden. Mm, not good news right there, magician. I'm probably going to let a couple of the other ones go that I did. This is my fourth one. Um, this is the past. Somebody from the past. Some, And then we get a tower moment. Okay, we got the tower here. So some there's going to be some sort of uh, shock. Okay, the tower is a shock. Sh this is this is shedding the light. Okay, this somebody is about to see the light in regards to a deceptive situation from the past. All right, somebody has been reluctant to move on. They have been unable to move on. There's a very strong bond here. There's a strong desire. There's been demons. There's been addictions. There's been um, ego and pride in the way. I feel as though we have somebody here that is taking action to bring success. It's like I'm, somebody has found the resources 
to um, bring success. This is not good news, though. Somebody is giving up on somebody that was not well-suited for them, okay? This is a suitor that is not well-suited for you, and this is not putting in effort. I feel like we have somebody here that is deciding not to put in any more effort. They're deciding to take action. The magician takes act, takes action. Here, there's some sort of obsession or there's an addiction that has been in the way of success, but it feels as though somebody is... unable to move on from somebody from their past that's what we got here somebody is unable to move on and now they are seeing an interest it's like they they're very interested they're very interested they may want to go back they may be obsessed with going back maybe they've learned a lesson maybe they've learned a lesson about what love really is and what love really isn't. Maybe they've realized that they didn't put in effort, you know. They, they didn't put in enough effort. They didn't work hard enough. Keep in mind that this is my fourth reading. So this does play in line with the rest. And you know, four is definitely a lucky number for me. So anyway, um, this is, somebody is about to see the light. I think that that's what this is. I think the light is being shown. Somebody is about to see the light. There's a reconnection with the past. I feel like somebody has been trying to, with that emperor that came out as a challenge, they've been trying, clinging to control. You know, they were trying to, maybe they're trying to prove a point or they were worried about what society was going to think. Maybe they were worried about what everybody else was going to say. But I think we have somebody here that is taking action to face their demons about the past. So we have a, we have somebody here that has learned a lesson. This is a life lesson. A lesson has been learned. And now they're seizing a new opportunity. They're seizing an opportunity for love. Now they see love. It's like they see it. It's like this is a big, huge opportunity for love. Maybe they get some sort of epiphany. This does have something to do with the past. There's a lot of, of memories here. There's a lot of uh, nostalgia, um, romanticizing about the past. This person is willing. The magician is willing. I'm willing to do whatever it takes to bring success. So it looks like we have somebody here that is, is like giving up on putting in effort with somebody that's not well suited for them. They haven't been following their heart and they learn their lesson. They decide to follow their heart. Yeah, there's, there's, there's a rejection here. Two sixes reversed. Somebody made a poor decision. Somebody made a poor decision. And they've learned their lesson. Absolutely. They're, they were trying to escape reality. And they've been growing frustrated. And they've been having a lot of ups and downs and highs and lows in their life. And they haven't been able to come together very well with anybody else. I feel like somebody has been really deceiving themselves. Wearing a mask. With addictions. Somebody has been hiding their truth with addictions for sure. And now there's some sort of rejection. There's some sort of loss. There's a loss. Oh, of course there's a loss. Yes, there is a big loss. A loss of a golden opportunity. She's holding the Ace of Pentacles in her hand. It's a loss. So I think that we have somebody here that is, has lost their focus again. They've lost their concentration and they're, they've lost a golden opportunity. And I feel like they are seeing what they have lost. Now they want to work together. Now they now they want to make some compromises. Now they're willing to compromise. They're willing to prove themselves. So somebody may be just communicating. They may be deciding to communicate and to prove themselves. They've learned some sort of lesson. They didn't reciprocate. They they 
They let pride and ego get in the way. They let their addictions get in the way. They were probably dealing with somebody who was very possessive, somebody that was very stubborn, somebody that was willing to compromise with them, which caused a power struggle. And they just they they, they can't they can't let go. They can't let go. They can't they can't move on. We got somebody here that can't move on from somebody that once gave them a golden opportunity. <laughs> This is a fresh start, starting over. I mean, this is going to be very similar to the last one. So this is starting from scratch, a new beginning, replacing that fear with faith, stepping into the unknown. We got somebody that is deciding to step into unknown territory, face their fears, replace that fear with faith and go after what they want. We have a change in direction, a change of course. This is meant to be. This is destiny. It's fated. This is, this is, this is the end of one chapter in the beginning of a new one. Somebody has learned a major life lesson about what love is. And they are about to embark on a new journey and they're going to leave everything else behind. Okay. This is major. It's major, 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 major. This is univer major, universally guided, major. So we have a major change in direction here. Somebody is about to embark on a new journey. They're going someplace they've never been before. Okay, this is, this is, this is someplace you've never been before. Stepping into a new path with faith. It's like all of a sudden they see the light and they go for it. So there could be definitely be some travel here. Somebody may be traveling. They may be moving. Deciding to work with somebody else. They are giving up on an unrequited love situation though because the magician sheds the old and that is unrequited love. So somebody is shedding an unrequited love situation and deciding to work with somebody else. It's like they're spinning that wheel. They're allowing it. They're no longer fighting. And it's been a challenge with that emperor that came out sideways. It's been a challenge to let go of control and to go for it. But this is a day where somebody decides to go for it. It's like I, I'm going. I'm seizing this opportunity. This is an opportunity to start fresh, to start over. It's meant to be. So that's what I got. That is, this is a golden opportunity to go down a new path. This is something you can bake on, bank on. This is something that you can save. This is something solid. This is a golden opportunity that could last. This is your path to abundance. This is the opportunity of a lifetime. Somebody gets presented a golden opportunity and I think they take it. Somebody has learned a lesson. This is, this is good luck. Whatever is happening is meant to be. It's good. So we have a new start here that includes, it's going to bring you something solid, stable, something long-term. This is a long-term situation. This is good fortune and this is fortune as well. So this is, this is, this is good. But I think it, there's already been some sort of loss and it's an opportunity to start over. Somebody has been hiding their feelings about the past with addictions. And they've lost a golden opportunity. And now there's an opportunity to start over. This could be with somebody new. This is a new beginning either way. Definitely. We got a, a new beginning here that could lead to something solid and stable. We are dealing with an Aries, a Sagittarius, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, 
Capricorn, Gemini, everybody. Everybody is here. Doesn't really matter. But we have a change in direction that is meant to be. Expect the unexpected. Expect the unexpected. I mean, that's all I can say. Right now, I got my hands on my throat. <laughs> oh my goodness. This is a new opportunity. This is a golden, I mean, a golden opportunity. Somebody's about to take that path. They're going to take the path to abundance. They see it. They see it. It's like they see it. So I think there's going to be some sort of communication. Somebody decides to take action. They have this strong desire to start over. To start fresh. And, you, and the Wheel of Fortune is an, another card. I mean, it's, it's, it's angel. Angel protection. It really is. So, something that has been hidden is about to be shown. It's about to come to light with the moon card. It's been below the surface, but I don't feel like it can be hidden much longer because I think the opportunity is too big to be missed. Be prepared. Somebody's... Somebody's life lesson. Somebody has learned a life lesson. And they're about to start with a clean slate. And that is what I got. Good luck. Fourth time's what? Fourth time is what? A blessing. Good luck. 